Hey YouTube, I'm going to bring you another improvised weapon. This is a still chainsaw. Picked it up for 200 bucks. I use it to cut wood, cut down trees, and help out my father-in-law. It's a great, great chainsaw. Just wanted to give you some of the perks of using a chainsaw as an improvised weapon. See, it's got to have a fuel. You got to mix your fuel 50-50 uh, oil and fuel. So if you have access to fuel in a crisis, that would help. And then another issue that I found is bar oil. If you got like 30 gallons of that and 30 gallons of fuel mixed for this, then you'll do just fine in, I don't know, a zombie apocalypse or an apocalypse situation where you got to kill people with the chainsaw. But other than that, your bar will get all sorts of messed up if you don't have bar oil. It's a pull start. It works great for cutting trees. Another issue, I think, is if you use it to kill something or someone, you'll, you're going to cover yourself in blood or their diseased blood. Great idea for a weapon because it's spinning it's gonna cause great amount of damage G real fast real fast it causing great amount of damage easy to wield kind of like a sword so think of it as a rotating sword blade it's pretty good there but as far as if I would use it I don't think I'd have the fuel or the oil Try and keep it minimalist. I don't want to carry 30 gallons of fuel or a 50 gallon drum with me everywhere I go. Well, thanks for listening to my ideas. Click like and subscribe.